Here's a squirrel in the snow up to his shoulders. He must have found his stash of acorns. Looks like he's enjoying dinner. Oops, he just ducked. He should be up soon. Unless he's in the tunnels. There he is. The South Carolina chickadee in the roosting box. He's got a black cap, his face is white. He's hunkered down, it's kind of warm in there, I think, for him. I wondered how long it would take before somebody decided to take advantage of the shelter. He actually seems quite content just to sit there. My patio window steamed up so it's kind of not making a very good clear picture. Hopefully it'll show better on the film.
Time for a snack. Fluffed out his feathers and sat back down. They let air in between their feathers and that acts like insulation to keep them warm. There's a black-eyed junco just off to the left. He's investigating. He's eating the seed that I put out to draw him to the box. He has a yellow beak. He's all black. With a white underbelly. Okay, the chickadee flew away up to the tree. Uh, he's gone. Mr. Junko has a yellow beak. He's kind of got himself all poofed out to keep warm. I just saw a crow fly by into the wind blowing the other direction. I just broke up this ice about an hour ago, put more water in there, and it's freezing up. Now, they said when I bought the thermostat-controlled bird bath that it would get ice around the edges, but the center would stay open, and so far it has, but I don't know how long it'll do that with the temperatures getting down to 45 below. Blowing across the water freezes it. Had a few birds taking a drink. Nobody's taking baths today. I don't know why. I suppose maybe it's a little bit too cold. He's still there. Just clinging to the tree, staying out of the wind. He was the one that was hunkered down in the bird hutch. Got a squirrel coming down the condo tree. Let's see how far he comes down. He's on the back side so I can't see him. The nuthatch just flew to the other bird feed area where there's black sunflower seeds, black oil sunflower seeds. He just flew through. Lost the squirrel. Now he's found a peanut and he's pecking at it to eat it. Peanuts are high energy for the birds. And in this cold weather they need high energy. I have some homemade suet that's got lard, peanut butter, cornmeal, and bird seed in it that I made myself and they seem to really like it. He's really working that peanut over. He's holding it in his claw and then pecking at it.
just barely see the head of the peekaboo squirrel. They must have tunnels. There he goes. He's going back up the tree. They come down forage for some acorns or nuts that they have buried. And then they go back up to the tree and sit on a branch and eat them usually. Back over here at the breakfast club tree we still have the nuthatch. Looking for more peanuts I believe. They're pretty birds. There he goes. There's his flight. There he is. He's on the wall. They like to cling to the wall. And he flew down. Let's see where he goes. Yep, he's down there right in front of the bird box.